Paul Rudd, 53, has spent the last few days in London promoting his latest appearance in the MCU, Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania. However, a radio show became the actor's undoing when a Welsh woman asked him his opinion on a dilemma of hers live on the air. Paul and the Crown star Olivia Colman, 49, have been friends for over two decades, having first met when they were both stage actors in London. Over the years, as Paul garnered fame in action and comedy flicks while Olivia's dramatic prowess earned her an Academy Award, the pair remained friends. However, it appears things may have taken a slight turn as Olivia pranked her friend on live radio, insinuating that he hadn't even told her he would be in England this week. During Friday's breakfast show on BBC Radio 1, the Clueless star joined Greg James to promote his new Marvel blockbuster with a segment called Agony Ant-Man. Paul, who plays Ant-Man, was to try and help listeners with their problems, and one particular caller made it through the volumes of fans ringing in. The Welsh woman started by praising the actor saying she was a huge fan, and had a serious friendship dilemma she needed help with. The caller asked, what would you do if you had a really, like a really good mate, like for over 20 years? Then this friend, yeah, he doesn't live in England, but he's come to England but he hasn't told you about it? Then, not only has he not told you about it, he's come on to a radio show. What would you do? Olivia's acting skills fooled many listeners as she tried to sound nervous talking to the movie star, but not Paul as the actor's face filled with realization as she went on. He grumbled, oh my god. Oh no. The actress continued, would you be offended? Don't miss, realizing the debacle he was in, Paul acted along to try to give himself a way out, saying, personally, if it's me? Absolutely not. I tend to give everybody the benefit of the doubt. The caller revealed herself as Olivia, much to the approval of Paul who added, Wow you really can do every accent. Olivia had planned the prank call, with cooperation from the radio host, days before when she first heard her friend would be making an appearance. The actors occupy vastly different areas of cinema and television now, so much so that few fans knew of their friendship before the prank call. Fans flocked to social media, sharing their shock and awe at the surprising pairing with many noting, life is better after knowing that this friendship exists. The hilarious duo first met when they were both starring in a play together in London, and Paul slept on the floor of what Olivia described as our rubbish flat in South London. She explained. Paul was properly in the play, and I had about two lines I think. 